My name is Adam of Grayskull. When good is threatened by the power of Eternia, I have the power! I was summoned to the future by the last of mankind to defend them in their hour of need. But my old enemy, Skeletor, followed me. Now, here in the future, he has found new allies to help him in his never-ending fight against all that is good. Yet on Primus, I too have found new brave friends and a new family. Thus, with the power of the good and the way of the magic, we struggle against the forces of darkness. Good against evil. The battle continues. The great minds of Primus can no longer stop the mutants from breaking through Primus's protective shield. Therefore, He-Man, hero of Castle Grayskull, has been transported to the future to save the universe and the future of mankind. But Skeletor, his forever enemy, follows our hero to the future. He-Man arrives just in time to defeat Skeletor in a whirlwind battle and pledges to the people of Primus that he will be their protector and defend them against any that try to take their freedom. However, the battle has just begun because Skeletor has found new cohorts, Flog and his band of mutants. I've been waiting for holes in the shield. We can invade Primus. <clears throat> Flog, ruler of Primus. Uh, no, no, no. Uh, Flog, king of Primus. No, wait, wait. I've got it. Uh, Flog, king of the Tri Solar System. Has a nice ring to it, eh? Not bad. And all I ask is that you let me have He Man. Hey, you have to get rid of him anyway, and I know how to do the job. All right, all right. I suppose you're right. This He-Man is going to cause problems until we've got him out of our way. So what's our next move, Flog? <laughs> Getting these things out of my face. Our first move, my green friend, is to lure He-Man from Primus and into my little trap. And that means sending you down to Primus to take some pictures for us. Can you do that? I knew you could. Are we taking orders from him or you? Flob, king of the Trisolar Galaxy? We'll try it Skeletor's way. Could there be a wiser mutant in the universe? I think not. Here's the tube that will take us down to Honor. I'm certain the Inner Council will be more interested in meeting He-Man than my nephew. By the power of Eternia? Oh! It's gonna take some time for me to get used to that. is perfectly right. There's no sense arguing. You're all brilliant. You all have Primus's best interest at heart. It's Zebrian who wastes your time on nonsense like time travel. Am I allowed to defend myself? Now comes the genius who had you waste your energies on a time machine instead of building new weapons for our defense. But I have brought you a great defender. His name is He-Man. This is what you sent Hydran and Flipshot to the past for? A single man to defend our planet? <laughs> Madness! This is no ordinary man. Mutant ship spotted entering Primus's atmosphere, headed for the Oasis. The Oasis? Drissy and Kaz are up there. Drissy? Slushy. 
You are the Quagmi Swamp taking pictures. What a waste of talent. Pictures of Titus, Leviton, the Guardian Sea, and now this bracky metal. You'd think I was doing a photo layout from Mutant Magazine. Drissy, do you think it's true there are holes in the shield? Oh, those are rumors, Kaz. The scientists, Master Sebrian, and the Inner Council have always protected us. Then how did the mutants get in? If one of them got through again, I'd love to get my hands on him. hi -ya! Ya! Ya! I wish you'd spend as much energy tending our animals. What is it, little one? What's wrong? Kaz, quickly, to the tube! What is it, Drissy? Run! Don't ask questions! What's this? There's something about someone running to hide that just brings out the evil inside. I'm only supposed to take pictures, but instead... Here comes a present from old Slashhead. My brother and I are grateful. Kaz, this is He-Man, a new friend and protector of Primus. He's sure doing a great job so far. Tell me how this happened, Slushhead. It's simple. All that water in there affected his brain. I don't like the way you handle my men. I can always leave, if you wish. Perhaps the people of Primus would give me a warmer welcome. Oh, wait. I didn't say you should go. Of course. A simple misunderstanding. And now, your highness-to-be, can we look at those pictures of Primus that Slushhead took? I don't get why we need these dumb pictures. It's all part of my plan, Slushhead. First, we lure He-Man away from Primus. Then we send you, Hoove, and... Too much brain strain, eh, Slushhead? All right, let's get started. Titus is the site of Primus's Trifusian generator. Without it, the temperature of their planet would become unbearable. And the best part is, the only place they can get crystals to run the generator is on our planet in Gorn City. Here it comes. Special delivery from Slushhead. Defense, no resistance. Mission accomplished. We're heading back. I know you're down there somewhere, She Man. Come get the crystals. Come to Gorn City. Come to me. Come to me, He Man. You are mine. <laughs> When the mutant ships invaded through the crack in our shield, they attacked the Trifusium generator and destroyed the crystals that run it. Without those crystals, the temperature on Primus will rise and destroy us. But Gorn City is the only place the crystals are mined. We just can't stroll in and ask them for crystals. There is no other solution. Unless we get more crystals, Primus will burn up. It, it would mean raising the starship from honor. Of course, a baller jet would never make the journey to Denebria. The 
ship has every weapon system you can imagine. Incredible power. A ship? A weapon like this? Why hasn't it been used? The shield protected us so well for so long that weapons like this were outlawed. Now it's up to us to protect our people. Freeing this starship is a start. This is the moment we've waited all our lives for, Flipshot. The starship is gonna fly. We're gonna get our wings at last. Look, Drissy, it's the starship. Easy, little ones. I'm gonna go see it. Kaz! Right on time. Are you all ready for the mission? I was born ready, Mara. Master Severian asked me to give you this. They're Romdial gems. The traders in Goran City will accept them in exchange for the crystals. Good luck, He-Man. He-Man, you're going on a mission, aren't you? Can I go along? I can whip those mutants. <laughs> I'm sure you could, Kaz. I'm afraid your sister would whip us if we let you come along. I certainly would. Fighting mutants, it's not a boy's job. Aw, Drissy. And don't aw Drissy me. Now back to the flock. I wish you safe journey, He-Man. Ready, Flipshot? Ready, Hydran. This is the best day of our lives. Sneaking on the ship isn't the way to help out. Bad enough we gotta go to Denebria. Now there's a kid along, too. Engines off. I don't like it. Not a mutant ship the whole way. Something's not right. Let's go! You're not going anywhere. I'll be back soon with the crystals. So, we're gonna stay back here with the ship, then? Yes, that way I can call you if there's trouble. Let's go, Gleep. Want me to carry that for a while? Kaz, what are you doing here? Bring on the mutants! The first rule of a good soldier is to obey orders. I told you to stay back at the ship. Well, I didn't mean to. Maybe you didn't, but you've got to learn to think before you act. All right, stick close when we get to Gorn City. A trading post. Maybe someone in there has Trifusium crystals for trade. Wait for me out here. See that he stays out of trouble, Gleep. <laughs> I hear I can trade for Trifusium crystals in this place. Anything can be had here for the right price. And would this be the right price? Melia! A traitor with Romdeal gems. 
Home deal gems, you say? Yes, I need trifusium crystals. I don't have any here. Meet me at Shaft 13 in Goldenworks Mine in Half a Crow, just outside of town. Shaft 13, I'll be there. this miner. He was supposed to be here by now. But I am here, He-Man. How did you know my name? A friend of yours told me. I want no gems. Skeletor will pay me a thousand times their worth. Skeletor? As I thought. Primus needs those crystals! Wait! Let the boy go. Who cares about the boy? Meliab lost his son to a cave-in. Send the boy away, He-Man. I do not fight with children. Kaz, go with Glee. And don't argue. Uh. Go on, boy. Your life is spared. Uh. Uh. Stands the drill. The medal of good and right. Take him. Take him now. Just you and me, Meliak. Uh, not quite, He-Man. I was wondering when you'd show up, Skeletor. As for you, you have failed. Pay the price. Now, isn't that nice? He-Man, you're so sweet to help your enemies. Too bad you have no sword. Meliak, the sword. No. Just can't find good help nowadays. Here's your precious crystals. No, no, no! Have a nice trip, Skeletor. Some days, nothing goes right. That should be more than enough crystals to run the generator. You saved the planet, He-Man, and, well, Flipshot and I were talking. We've decided we'd like to name the starship in honor of your homeland. Starship Eternia? <laughs> yes, I like that. Thank you both. All right, Kaz. Come on and take the controls. I've had a long day. D do you mean it, Captain Hydra? <laughs> sure. You can't do any worse than Flipshot. <laughs> <laughs> I know this place like the back of my tentacle. Things change. The level of the water might be lower than it was before. You should check before you dive in. It's my swamp. I'm going in. That's why I'm the boss. Listen to me next time and check the depth of the water before you dive in. All right, I will. <laughs> 